Good morning, everybody. I hope everyone is doing well. Hello, Wonderland Ellis. I hope you're doing great. Sorry about the frame drops, folks. That it's looking really, really bad. I'm gonna try and power through it, but I don't know if my stream's gonna hold or not. Jeez, this is horrible. It doesn't seem to like my internet today. Let me check one of the settings. But good morning, good morning. I'm looking at settings for my internet, so I apologize that if I'm silent and the stream is going with my voice not talking. Alright, so I'm still looking. Trying to see if there's something wrong with one of my settings. Because this is not gonna this is not gonna jive if it continues like this. Hello, how are y'all doing? I'm here. Here's my pink monkey. Good morning. I hope you're well. I do apologize about the drop frames. It looks like according to this, I've stabilized it according to the internet. We're going to try and figure it out. Hopefully it will stay stable. Anyway, let me turn on my timer. It's I like starting at 7.30 when I'm, uh, well, I like starting at 7.15. Obviously I couldn't do that today. It's 7.30 on my clock now, so let's start stretching. Let's start doing what we need to do to make everything... Um, <laughs> to exercise, you know, that's what we're here for. Look, my hair is uncombed. You see the bald spots on my head. You can tell it's me. It's not a clone. I'm trying to stay positive. All right, so... Um, Move the mat back just to get it. Just a tiny, tiny bit. That looks good. All right, monkey here, timer here. Let's get this going. Hopefully, now there goes frame drops again. Let's get it, yep, let's do it. All right, right there. So start. Arm stretched out. I'm having some issues again. So make sure arms all the way out, hands all the way out. Head, forehead touching the mat. Arm stretched all the way out. Give a good stretch. Get up. Elbows down to the ground. Put your stomach on the mat. Hands now palms and arms straight. Push that lower back. Give a good stretch. Back up. Adjust as necessary. As you can see, I kept my arm straight this entire time. I just shifted. My knees are down on the ground, as you can tell. And I'm just going to keep shifting back and forth with these two moves. Adjust as you need to. 
until uh, the timer goes off. Which is about five seconds. This also helps shoulders. Regular shoulders. I'm gonna get that bar and I'm gonna start pushing that bar. Okay? That's our next thing. I'm gonna check on chat. Something posted. What happened? It just reposted the name of my stream? Yeah, it dropped so much frames that it restarted me. It says I'm not, it says I've started The Last of Us. It, it, it shouldn't be The Last of Us. It should be the get out of bed head. All right, so I do apologize if my stream is saying The Last of Us. It's not, it's the get out of bed head exercise stream. I'm updating it. Hopefully it'll stay updated. We'll see how it goes. I don't know why it's doing that. Again, do apologize if the frames are going in and out. We're getting with the bar. We're gonna pull a little forward here. Just side to side. I'm pushing. This hand here is pulling this way. This other hand is pulling that way. So we're going against each other. You can see, try and keep it straight. Use a mirror if you have to, if you have one available to you. And just keep pushing this arm outwards. Switch sides. Keep it straight. You don't want it all crooked. Gracie, come here, please. Sorry about the dog barking in the background. And we're gonna do some different shoulder stretches. Again, all this is designed to stretch out your shoulders. With the weather being the way it is, I need the stretch. So this stretches your back, it stretches your shoulders, stretches your arms. And I think that's what we're gonna do the entire stream. My body is very, very sore, even though I didn't exercise yesterday. I either didn't sleep right, I don't know what the issue is, but let's just do a whole round of stretches for this entire stream. Hydrate as you need to. some stretching. Shifting side to side. Oh my goodness. Yeah, my legs need a good stretch too. So, I'm holding on to this for stability. Notice how my toes pointed on my right leg towards my vehicle, straight. The other one's the opposite. I'm 
Try to keep both feet on the ground. Give good stretch. I'm using this as well. You don't need it. You can do it like such. I'm only doing it because I'm again pulling down, trying to loosen up that very sore shoulder that's really causing some issues with my hands this morning. So I'm pulling down to get all of this muscle working along with the leg. So with this hand, I'm pushing down to the ground, really, really hoping for a good stretch, stabilizing with this hand, you get the idea. And we're just going to continue back and forth, stretching the body. Tuesday today for me, maybe Tuesday night, Wednesday morning for some of you. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, this week I plan to do exercise stream. That's the plan. Sorry about my dog being extra talkative today. She's normally not this talkative. Not sure what her issue is. And there's a timer for that stretch. Oh. This is a good yoga exercise that you can do as well. You stretch up slowly, put your hands together, put your hands together like such. Pull it up above your head and then invert it. Turn it upside down. It's actually gonna be like such. So you see my hands are towards you. Now you're gonna push it to the sky, all the way up. Then you're gonna go on your tippy toes. Hands on top of the head, then up, turn hands inwards, push to the sky, feet up, ooh, that is a total body stretch right there. Back down. Show you the side view, my stomach view, <laughs> the large stomach view. Again, we're all about body positive here. But this is just to help get your body in limber, stretchable state. We're not worried about the size you look like. We're worried about your mental health. Oh my goodness. And keeping your heart in good shape. So you don't have to take blood pressure medicines and things like such. Wow. That stretch right there, for me, the uh, total body. Stretch of my shoulders, my arms, back, feet, legs, everything. Push to the sky. Oof, you start losing your balance. Adjust. One more. You don't have to get on your tiptoes if you don't want to. Start losing your 
balance, which I am, adjust. And there's the timer. Whew. So these exercises are very simple, very easy to do. Oh man, I know what it is. The category, the category is wrong. Now I see it. It is a morning for me. There we go. Now I have six, the category fitness and health. So people are not popping in and out going, well, I thought he was doing the last of us. It says last of us. Oh my goodness. I feel like I haven't ever streamed before. We're 15 minutes into the, <laughs> we're 15 minutes into the stream and I just barely changed this setting to fitness and health. I do apologize. That's why I call it get out of bed head because I'm so sleepy half the time that I can't figure out what's going on. All right, so I can't read the screen. I need to look at the timer to see where we're at. All right, it says I've been live for 18 minutes. We're gonna continue with a stretch. 18 minutes in, and I finally put it on fitness stream. Hello. <laughs> Good morning. Apparently it's, I have not woken up yet. Let's be fair, come on. Timer needs to be at three minutes. Ooh, that, that hurts. Slow it down. I was gonna do this for cardio, go back and forth really quickly like such, but when I got to here, I feel a lot of hurt, a lot of pain, so I need to stretch that. I don't want to re-injure my already injured shoulder. Whoa! Ooh. Right when I get there, that motion, my triceps, my biceps, my, uh, tendon, bicep tendon is not happy with me right now. All right, so it looks like this cold weather has got me uh where the muscle is contracted, it's not stretched. So it's feeling some pain. I gotta give a good stretch. Make it work. So I'm trying to get this as much behind my back, my arm strength, straight, going back and forth. I'm trying to push this as much behind the back of my head as I can, because that's where I feel the tension. This is all about motion, range of motion. If you can't, Keep it stretched and working the strength on it. It's going to continue to get injured. It's going to continue to give you issues. You can put a heating pad, a hot towel, a heating pad on the area to help warm it up. But you do have to stretch it. You can't ignore it. You got to strengthen it by stretching it out. The stretch is the most important thing. Get it maybe at two pound weight. Do curls with the two pound weight. Oh. 
Okay, that timer is going to go off in about two seconds. There it is. Okay. I'm going to keep doing some push ups on my knees. Maybe I'm not. The second I put my hands on the ground to do the push ups, I mean I got pain. So, up. So right now, hello, how are you? So right now, the this part of my hand, for whatever reason, is giving me a lot of pain. Carpal tunnel, probably. Even though I don't use my left hand for hardly anything. I saw a comment in chat. I can't read it at the moment because my glasses are off. I'll read it after I do this. But welcome, good morning. I hope life in whatever area you're in is doing well. Yeah, I can't continue. I'm trying so hard to push through that. I can't do that. So, instead, we're gonna do the push-ups like such. Forehead down into the fetal position. Elbows touching your knees. Then up to your hands punching the fists. Then down. Back forehead down, then back up. Arms locked straight. Then down. Still doing your push-ups. Just doing a very modified one. Still getting strength in those arms. You're really pushing those arms. You're trying not to use any of your back. You're trying to use your hands and your arms to push yourself up. In other words, you're pushing your shoulders down to the mat. Gently pushing down as you are pushing up with your arms. So that's how we're modifying this push-up for you today. All my arms are feeling the soreness of a normal push-up, but we're trying so hard not to use the back because I can easily, no hands, use the back, but that's not what we're trying to do. We're trying to get the arms to get exercise today. So modify as you need to in order to get things to work. Don't forget, it's Breast Cancer Awareness Month. This is Pink Monkey with me that's with me all the time. Get yourself checked. Early detection is the best prevention. Anubi is here. Thank you, Anubi. How are you doing today? Hope life is good. I'm having a lot of pain here. So what I also do whenever I have an area that is painful, where it's hurting too much to exercise it, I show a series of stretches or I show alternate things you can do in order to not hurt yourself more. So continue to work on areas and work around areas that are injured. What I have been doing for a while now, for almost two months, is getting rid of a very bad shoulder injury with my uh, bicep tendon that got pretty well, uh, how can I say, uh, wasn't torn, but it was severely strained. We'll put it that way. So, gotta continue to exercise it, stretch it, especially on cold days. It's cold in South Texas today. I think it was 68 degrees in my house this morning. So my whole body feels like it's uh, like this cement ground here. Stiff as a board, 
So I'm doing a lot of stretches today in order to get past that. So instead of doing a lot of cardio like I like to do, I'm doing nothing but stretching today. Tomorrow, depending on how we're feeling, if I do the exercise stream tomorrow, which is all the plans, I'm planning to do it. We'll do cardio, again, depending on how I'm feeling. So my shoulder's still very tight. I'm gonna get the TENS unit, the electrical unit, to shock my muscles today. I'm also gonna get a heating pad in order to get that worked out, that knot that's starting to form in my shoulder again. The last thing I wanna do is re-injure. So this stretch here, you can see I'm holding it. This pulls on that sore, tight tendon. And you wanna keep it even on both sides. I'm also straight leg, feet flat. Trying to keep my feet straight, but I'm a little bit outwards. Trying to keep my back straight. And just letting my shoulders, my arms and my shoulders do the work. So I'm getting the pull total body. My legs, my shoulders, my arms. Mm. Don't forget, hydrate is very, very important. Always hydrate. I'm total sore today, not total body. All right, so we've done level, several stretches. On this here, see how I have my leg down? Now I'm picking up the back one. You can't see it too well, but I just did five. Let's turn to the side view of the leg. Straight. See how this one's completely down? Hands right here, actually crossed. I have it like such. And I'm going to actually, uh, tell you what, both hands on my knee. Then up, up, two, three, four, five. Keep working those legs, alternate. You can go to 10 if you want. Keep alternating. You notice how I'm going slower? Because I want you. I'm taking a break. One, two, three, four, five. Right on this entire top muscle, right where it begins to my hip, all the way to the top to my knee. I'm feeling that burn. If this is too much for you, just lean forward. One, two, three, four, five. There you go, you can lean into it if it's too much to pick your leg off. We'll do the other one. Make it the same for both sides. Don't do one where you pick your leg up and then one where you don't the other. You want to keep the exercise even. One for both sides. Two, three, four, five. So what ends up happening is, especially when you're injured, is you'll start not doing the same exercise for both areas strengthening one area and bathing the other, not strengthen it, so all of a sudden, you're overcompensating. You don't want to overcompensate. You can also go one, hand down, hand on knee. Two, three, four, 
five. So do what works for you. I'm gonna have to put a fist on this. I can't put my hand flat. One, two, three, four, five. Now I'm feeling all the bottom side of my leg where I'm feeling that pull. A lot of leg exercises I do because that's the most important part of what a runner needs. A runner like myself depends on his legs, but the other part that runners really depend on is the breathing. So make sure when you're breathing, it's through the nose and the mouth, and you're exhaling through the nose and the mouth. Don't hold your breath. Make sure you're working on breathing. Breathing is really important. So cardio, when you do cardio and breathing, work it together right. All right, so we're very, very close to the end. One more set of something, anything. <sighs> Starting to feel the sweat coming on, and all we've done today is stretch inside the, ex inside the exercise room. What temperature is it? It says it's 71 degrees. It's beautiful out here. So, again, I want everyone to see. Let's see if that shows up. I'm not a fitness model. Let's pull that in too tight. I'm not a fitness model. You can see the stomach on me. Turn all the way around. Look like Santa Claus here. I'm not a fitness model. I exercise to get good cardio for myself. I exercise to keep my legs in good strength because I enjoy running. But I want to get this upper body going again. I want to get strong. I want to suck this in, make it look like such, where my chest is big and my stomach is flat. That's what I want for me. But more than anything, I want for me is to get myself in better health. My heart health is not the best in the West. And through the cardio, through some better eating habits, I'm gonna get there. So I'm all about body positive, because trust me, look at that. This is definitely, I'm pushing that a lot more than I am. Let's be normal. A lot of this is not good for my health, okay? But I'm not here to shame anyone or shame myself. I'm here to get myself in better health. I want you to join me. I want you to come along for the ride. Better health is key for longer living. Also helps in air, lots of different areas as well. It's so, all right. Um, we're gonna end it here. Do the cool down exercises. I'm gonna Come back tomorrow, depending how I feel, and do another round of 30 minute exercise. This time I make sure that the stream says 30 minute exercise and I have it set to fitness and health, not the last of us. <laughs> so the right now all I'm doing is walking back and forth and stretching my legs. All we did this entire time was just stretch. You still gotta do cool down even if you did just stretch, okay? So do the cool down. Make sure that is happening because that's important as well. So remember, you're just telling your body you're done. Even if you just stretch it the entire time, you need to tell your body you're done. Spaghetti noodles. So just relax, get the stretch in, relax. Don't forget to stay hydrated. Don't forget to get a warm towel to treat areas that need the warmth. Stretch longer, cool down longer if you need to. 
Again, all today was just pure stretch. There was no hardly any cardio at all. How are y'all feeling? I hope you all are well. Okay, have a great day during my lunchtime stream, 11.30ish, 12 noon, right in that front time frame. More The Last of Us DLC left behind. We're gonna continue that particular DLC. I like it so far. We'll continue that until it's completion and then we'll see what we do from there. But for those of you that just follow my exercise stream, Look for me tomorrow. If I'm not here tomorrow, I guarantee you I'll be here Thursday. If not, I'll post some on Discord explaining my absence. But I'm going to do my best effort to do a stream tomorrow. For sure Thursday. Two to three times a week is what I'm going to be doing this. Like I had said before and like I've said many times, it's back to three times a week. I want to get that done. i got to get that done. So, I've said it many times during stream. I'm gonna say it like I do it. I always say closing. Here's Pink Gorilla Man. He's gonna talk for me. He's gonna tell you. <laughs> Please don't wait to get yourself checked. Men and women can get breast cancer. Early detection is the best prevention. Get yourself checked. This is Breast Cancer Awareness Month in the United States. Have a great day, everybody. Bye. Take care. See you all hopefully for my lunchtime stream. On that note, why go forward alone when you go forward with backward? See you guys. Have a great day.